All right, unboxing time. We got fingerboards coming, getting dropped off today, tomorrow, next day, next week. I mean, the, as far into the future as you can see, there's fingerboards coming. It ain't stopping. It ain't stopping. I need to take a break. Um, boom. Bok Bok boards. Never heard of them. But got this on Macari. All right, so Bok Bok boards hooking it up here. Um, let's see. Cool. Nothing in there. Uh, looks like just the deck, some bubble wrap, and paper. All right, cool. Nothing too crazy going on. Um, grab it first. Um, come here, fingerboard. I don't know if I'm gonna like post uh, these fingerboards like unboxing separate, or if I'm gonna put them all in one. I'll probably put them all in one. Um, but I just wanted it to shred. Just to beat up on another one of them flat face, blah, flat face crystal decks. All natural plies in the middle, top blue ply. Yeah, I just wanted it to shred on. Just to shred, shred her down to the ends. So that's one to shred. That is like an outside deck. It's like an outside G15. You know what I mean? Like, I don't feel bad shredding this guy to hell. Uh, this next deck. I've ordered so much stuff I really don't remember. It's hard to like keep up with the tracking and be like this is what and stuff's coming in. So I don't know. Uh, we'll see though. I got an idea. Yeah, this is exactly what I thought. Oh. This came from the fingerboard group Fingerboarding Unlimited. Uh, dude's name on here is Alex. I'm pretty sure that's right. I must have left my phone. Oh, I'm recording with my phone. Duh. Um, on here it's Alex B. Um, what a boss. Um, he included a bunch of freebies. Um, some freebie stuff. Okay, Fingerboarding Unlimited, Alex B. Um, sticker. Sticker. Says, says Bull God FB. Bull God. Uh, teak tuning sticker, and then, um, wow, these are the originals, uh, close-up trucks, they got the little, you can't tell with this lighting, but there's the little close-up logo on the front side, um, I'm assuming maybe these are close-up wheels, because they come with bearing wheels, gray bearing wheels, and then, I'm not like a close-up fan, you guys, whoa, there's got wheels on here. No, these are close-up wheels. I'm tripping. I don't know what kind of wheels those are. Hmm. You have to ask him. Uh, so anyways, I'm not a close-up fan or anything, but I am a fan of old stuff you can't find. So anyways, he posted um, this close-up. This is a close-up deck, which they're kind of like entry-level fingerboards. Uh, but this one... Uh, it's from around like 2000, we'll just say from like 2011 to 2013, um, I believe. I could be wrong. But anyways, it's a close-up fingerboard with a flat face uh, graphic on the front. And um, the only thing I can see, like only info I can find about it is some YouTube videos that are like 12, 13 years old of people getting these things. And this thing's in great condition. Uh, he took the original tape off, so it's got some adhesive left on there. I was trying to peel it off. But blue top ply, then red, natural, red, natural, and then that flat face graphic. Um, 26 mil, gotta be. But yeah, throwback as fuck, and it looks great condition for what it is. Super stoked on that guy. Yeah, this guy's rocking. So he threw in a piece of tape, those stickers, uh, those trucks and wheels, and then this guy has a set of OG Tech Deck uh, trucks and wheels already on here. Ready to rip. Actually, really, feels pretty good. The shape is not bad. Stoked. All right, moving right along. 
I think I'm gonna make. Um, nah. Dang, this is already getting long. I missed out on that last on the drop, the original drop, and then Flint decided to do a reissue of uh, Flavio. Um, I always say Flavio Sosa. I don't know how you say that. Um, but this is like my first real Flint drop. Like I have a Flint, but not like I I didn't catch it from from him. I bought it secondhand. Um, so stickers, boom, boom. Just saying, this is a really nice sticker. Like the weight of it, like I know that sounds weird to say, but like that, I feel like I'm holding like a photo, like a really nice picture. Like that's nice. Um, almost dropped that right on the concrete, dude. I would've been so heated. <laughs> uh, that dude just popped right out of there. The one I have, the other one I have with the box, like it barely sits in there. That is really interesting, the way that graphic is on there. I've never seen that. Boom. Nice, nice, nice. And that one. Show off the shapes. Play a little better. Boom. Boom, I guess you can kind of tell. They're the same. They should be 32 millimeters. Um, yeah, they're the same type of shape. Natural plies, no colors, nothing like that to them. Um, but they are really nice. They're really nice. Like the like most real wear graphics like kind of cover up the wood grain in a way. Like these are nice. These are really nice. They're so mellow. Super mellow. But cool, nonetheless, collection grows. If you can't tell that this is a fingerboard collecting page by now. I mean, that's like my only thing. It's my only thing. Collect. You won't ever see me sell them. I'll trade them. I'm starting to start pussying out. Bam, dude. What a hell of a fucking unboxing. This Flint deck got here from Port from Portugal in like a week. He got here. Nah, that's wrong. It took longer than well when he actually shipped it out. Yeah, it took like a week. He got here in no time. Boom. Fingerboard collection going crazy, man. Crazy.